Hello guys, welcome back to SW Gaming Channel. Today I will introduce a new custom game of Dota 2, Atomic War. I have just played this game for two days and it's really fun guys. Because Dota Underlords hasn't updated yet, so you can try Atomic War. I'm still exploring, but I will try to explain the gameplay for you in this video. This is a trap phase. You can choose one hero to ban or activate. It depends on your strategy, but if you're a newbie, you can ignore this step. There are many heroes in Atomic War, but only 40 randomly selected heroes appear in the game. So you must learn a lot and have many different strategies. Then you will choose a lower, like Dota on the Lords. The lower will have different effects. It can be automatic or you activate manually. Some ability can cost you some gold. I refer Lord Bloodseeker. His effect is Blood Rage. You will pay 40 HP. If you win in the next round, you will restore 120 HP and do more damage to enemies. You can check the number of heroes by click tap heroes on the menu bar. Everything in Atomic War will cost 3 gold only. At the first round, you can choose one hero. Every hero has 4 skill like Dota 2. Skill will be performed from left to right in turn. Oops, Slug lift out my Shamno. The skill have cooldown and heroes can use it again if they have enough mana. The result of the first round is Jar, not bad. You can shopping at the end of the round. Atomic War is limited to only 5 heroes on the chessboard at a time. It's a 5v5 Dota 2 and I suggest to buy heroes. The goal will reset after a round, so you should spend them all. I don't have a strategy yet, so I buy heroes that I played before. You can change the order of the skill casting by dragging them around. I think Enigma should black hole immediately after midnight pose. No, there is Disruptor. Static stops Sun Enigma so he can't black hole. The goal will increase each round. The maximum goal is 12. You can buy heroes, skills, items. They all cost 3 gold and can be sold with 2 gold. And you can reroll by 1 gold. The position in Atomic War is flexible. You can place heroes everywhere in your area. Oh, black hole all of the enemies. This good. You can buy the same heroes to upgrade level, talents, and skills. When you buy one hero, you will revive four levels. The first hero is level six, and the maximum level is thirty. So you need seven heroes to maximize its change. Each hero has only 14 units in the game, so you should choose the hero to upgrade carefully. If there are many players who also choose the same heroes as you, it's hard to fight. I won't play Tinker, I use Crystal Maiden and Witch Doctor to combo with Enigma. Imagine Black Hole and Freezing Few in Dead World. It's gonna be a sick combo. I 
I think I can win next round, so I activate Blood Rage and pay 40 HP. If I win, I'll restore 120 HP and do more damage to the enemies. Yes, I won. The default HP is 400, but with leverage, I can have more HP. I have to upgrade Enigma Sniper, so use Blood Rage again. When you have enough fire heroes, you should consider upgrading your shop to have more good items. It will cost 4, 6, 8, 9, 12 gold. The crystal maiden dies so fast, so I sell her and buy Chirocopter. Call down is also a good combo with black hole. Oh no, I lost. Luckily, I didn't use Bird Rage. Dragon Copter is not really good, so I try Luna. I use Blood Rage this round. I won. Nice. There's nothing to buy, so I upgrade a shop. If you have something good to buy, but you don't have enough gold, you can lock them. And remember to check the hero bar to know which hero all the players are using.
I always prioritize hero updates over buying items because you can buy high tier items later. I'm on winning streak, so I'll upgrade the shop to max level. I on this is a good item here. The combat up atomic bar is so fast, so item helps zero survive is good. I forgot to use Blood Rage. I will use Blood Rage in the for next round. Nice, I have more HP. Okay, let's up the shop to max level. You can check all the players' views. Top 2 and top 3 are not really strong as me, I think. But I don't upgrade anything so I won't use Blood Rage this round. And please subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for the support. I was right. There are many items in order two and new items, so you must take time to explore them. I maximize the shop so I can grow a shopping now. I can use Blood Rage this round, hope it works.
I lost 40 HP and more damage. It hurt. Luckily, I still have a lot of HP. I need blacking bar for Enigma so it won't be silenced and Arcane Blink to help him black hole immediately. Boil Strike is a good skill here. I will replace two demonic conversion. I use Blood Rage again to have a chance to increase HP. Nice, I won. I can even show it's a good item for Enigma. The black hole is now wider. I'm confident to use Blood Rage. I won! Did you see that black hole? I also buy damage items for Sniper. I forgot Blood Rage, but luckily I lost.
I should change the position a bit. Also, I should use Enrage soon, so you can survive. Let's game up with Blood Rage this round. Well, I win the round with Blood Rage. Giant's ring is good. Oops, I have not to quit it yet. Tier 5 and 6 items is strong. Essence ship is a good skill here, and our base to take ammo sniper. Oops, I keep losing. Um, luckily, I didn't use Blood Rage and it's still top one. Argonium Skeptor is good. You can check its effect for hero in the skill tab. Okay, I should equip to Enigma. So Black Hawk can do extra damage based on the current level of Mina Pulse. Whoa, the black hole is awesome. Enigma do 10k damage in the combat. Every pet shop, you know what? Double black hole incoming.
telescope is good here. It increases the can range and amplification. Let's check the position and use blood rage to do more damage. Whoa, black holes, all the enemies. Enemy does it all. And I won. This is my first top one, guys. You can check the damage dealt by hero by clicking on the statistics. My sniper and enigma deal the most damage. You can learn many things from the other players built here. So, what do you think about Atomic War? Would you like to watch more video about this game? Please comment below to let me know. And if you like this video, you can like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching my video. I see you guys next time.